and I made a discovery about an object that appears in the heavens, in the stars, and somewhere on Earth, in one of the two hemispheres, it destroys or resets and causes all kinds of mayhem. And it was called the Appen, or the Pen, or the Fink, or the Phoenix. And I released all these videos and published books, and I showed that it was every 138 years, and the ancient Jews referred to it, the ancient Egyptians referred to it, the Druids knew about it, the Rosicrucians knew about it, the Masons knew about it, they, they, they designed their 33, 33 degrees behind it. And yet, while I'm in prison, I'm, re I'm releasing, I have books published about the phoenix, when the sun darkens, Nostradamus and the plants of apocalypse, shocking secrets of antiquity. I have three books published all about the phoenix. And yet, in all my studies, I figure out that this Phoenix history, the Phoenix history began in 4309 BC, and that the Phoenix history runs all the way to a point where Earth is moved from its place in the year 2046. And I use a calculator and I realize all these 138 year intervals, they end in 2040. But the cycle ends in 2046, the same thing David Davidson saw. He studied the Great Pyramid. He was an engineer in 1924. He designed a chart. Many of you have seen those charts in my other videos. And in that chart, he shows, without knowing anything about the Phoenix, without knowing anything about me, because I hadn't even been born for another 40 years when he wrote this, that the base diagonals of the Great Pyramid revealed that the orbital cycle for Earth would be altered in the year 2045. I realized in my own studies about Sodom and Gomorrah and the destruction of the United States and, and how the world was going to change in 2046, everything about the Phoenix history 